Hello, Color family. We just wanted to ask how you're doing, and we actually we ask we wanted to say thank you for being kind and polite to us. And uh, we'd like to thank you for all the things you've done, especially and uh, Jasmine from uh, good leadership in school and also for being a good friend to all of us. And um, we hope that wherever you're going. And we just like to say that if you, if you ever want to come and visit us, then and we'd like to say bye. Thank you. Um, the Wakola family will always have a special place in my heart. Um, when my family and I first moved to Fiji, they were the one of the few families that made us truly feel like we were home. Um, another thing is um, the, Wa the Wakola family is led by a man of God, a true man of God who is diligent. Um, uh, the Wakola is always considered a, a special blessing to our family and grateful for everything that he's done for us in the church. Um, a quality that I've learned from Elder Wakola himself and his family is the, the quality of selflessness. In other words, uh, their service to others. I've seen it a lot and, um, and I truly admire that quality. And I hope that um, the Wakolo family enjoy their trip to Arkansas, and I hope that they treat the Wakolo family well. I hope uh, Glenn and Jasmine enjoy their time, and I'm looking forward to seeing them again. Thank you. Uh, Wakolo family, one thing that I admire about them was this once, it was once this Christmas, I think last year, when you guys came all the way from Suva, and we as a family were at home during Christmas and we got shocked when a van pulled up and then the Wakolo family came out and started singing Christmas carols. I guess this was something that really opened my eyes to what Jeanette said, which was selfless service. That small act, it really made our Christmas different. It brought a more spiritual feeling to it. And just like what Jeanette said, the Wakolo family is led by a very spiritual man. And I think that is very true and I will truly miss the Wakolo family especially Glenn, the fun that he brought to our lives. I hope you guys do all the well, do well in your first area of being mission president. And good luck to you guys, thank you. It's been a privilege and a delight to work uh, with the older sister Wakolo. Uh, your contributions uh, both here in the service center schools and also at large in the church community has been uh, great and highly appreciated by by us all members uh, you have been a pillar of light and strength to many of us your examples has uh, touched the lives of many of our members and i'm sure they would uh, miss you we will all miss you as you uh, move forward in your future assignments may the lord's uh, choices blessings be upon you i must say i personally would like to um, thank heavenly father for the presence of your family uh, with your calling uh, elder wakolo that has helped us take care of the unseen thank you for staying strong standing steadfast and immovable with in terms of uh, standing for the truth and righteousness um, I truly am grateful for that and for always telling us that you love us enough to help us prepare well for the day when we will meet our Savior again. We hope that we can meet you again, uh, Wakolo family. We wish you all the best and uh, my sincere apology for things that may have happened. Um, please know that we love you and we're praying for you here in Fiji. We are grateful for your righteous example and uh, we're also thankful for helping us to be like our savior more thank you for giving me this opportunity to farewell the wakolos first i'd like to thank sister wakolo for for bringing our profit from primary school for the pgta thank you very much anita 
And uh, thank you, Elder Wakolo, for being a great example to all the Fijians in Fiji, especially in that position in the general authority area. Uh, first, I'd like to thank you and also thank the Lord for sending you to Arkansas. You know, in Arkansas, there are a lot of rare people there. They need to be reactivated over there. So I hope in your mission, you will look for these rare people where they are and reactivate them. And I know some of my families are also there. So I'm thankful that the Lord is sending you to a place. There is a purpose for you going there. And I'd like to thank for all, all the things you have done for primary, especially our student body leaders, being recognized at a very higher level and making them feel that the responsibility is of highly appreciated, especially from the church and also from the leaders here in Fiji. I'm so grateful for this opportunity to represent the Fiji LDS uh, Primary School. To share a few words of uh, gratitude to the Wakolo family. Elder Wakolo, we are so happy with your new assignment. We'd like to thank you very much for the wonderful contribution that you've given to our land and even to the nation. And we're not forgetting the Fiji LDS Primary School. We'd like to thank you for your leadership, for the love that you have for the Savior and even to the people of this land. Also like to acknowledge the contribution that uh, Sister Wakolo has done to the community and even to the people of Fiji as well. well I'll, on behalf of the Fiji TA, we'd like to thank Sister Wakolo for being part of uh, this committee. And we know that uh, Sister Wakolo your contribution will never ever be forgotten. Also like to recognize your children, Glenn Wakolo and uh, Jasmine Wakolo for their contribution in the school as well. We wish you all the best in this trip. We know that uh, you have an assignment to fulfill and the Lord will be with you at all times. From the Fiji LDS Primary School, we wish you all the best. We'd like to say goodbye and like to say more there to the family. Well, it's a very fond farewell to Elder and Sister Wakolo. Um, thank you so much for all that you have done. Uh, certainly uh, Elder Wakolo and your service in the service centre and as uh, an Area 70. Um, much appreciated. What I've noticed and very much appreciated from both of you is that you are a friend uh, to the people of Fiji, uh, to their education, and uh, because of that you are a great, fr great friends to the school. And uh, for that I'm uh, forever grateful. Uh, your patient ways and your uh, understanding, your uh, very sound decision making has made uh, certainly my visit and transition here to Fiji um, a lot more comfortable than it, than it uh, might have been. So thank you. All the best for your mission. I know very well that the Lord will be with you wherever you serve. And uh, as you well know, uh, he always compensates brilliantly for any sacrifices that we make in his service. So may the Lord bless you and thank you again for all that you have done for the people of Fiji and certainly for us here at LDS Church College. Thank you. Mm -hmm.